Hi guys, welcome to Iron Things. I am so happy you're here. It's 85 days before the start of the Dopey Challenge, which is the 5K, the 10K, the half and the full marathon in Walt Disney World, Florida in January. Are we crazy? Yes, we are. So today was Tuesday and we had on the schedule 45 minutes with intervals. The intervals are going to pop on your screen right now. Secretly, I wanted to do this interval run faster than what I did last week, which I did exactly the same interval run, but because it is done for time, I wanted to do more miles. One left, one thirty second left. Whew. This is great to get you going. And she's so motivating. Whew. We are on an extended recovery. We can start again running. Okay, okay. One final twenty seconds. We have to go all out on this one. Man. Five guys. Man. Oh. Okay. We're gonna bring the recovery down just a little bit. Oh. Man. She's saying you should stretch after this. He a bedja. Man. Okay. Whew. That was a killer. Okay, we walk home. Look at that. Loading. Training effect. Okay, this is what happened. Huh? Look at that, guys. I did a bunch of super hard efforts. And I was all done too. Well, I'll take it. Okay. Let's go home. Oof. Start the work day. I was going to go in the office today, but I'm not. I'm going to go tomorrow. Yeah. Recently, I have incorporated this protein shake into my routine and I take it after certain runs. I also really enjoy shaking the bottle because when in doubt, dance it out. And this is just one of those weird Garmin things. I'm not supposed to be peeking. After a protein shake and a quick shower, it's time to start my work day. The good thing about working from home sometimes is that you can set up dinner in advance, like here. This is honey chicken and it's a very easy recipe I make it quite often because it's easy to make and the craft pot makes it all for me. And here's where I ask that you please subscribe to the channel if you are liking what you're watching. Thank you. And if you're curious about this recipe, I am going to walk you through this recipe in just a second. Ah. 
Okay, so you need a crock pot and one breast, one chicken breast for every person. That's usually what I do that you are going to cook dinner for. So this recipe calls for honey, butter, Dijon mustard, honey, and curry. Curry makes life a lot better, you guys. And while I am cleaning my kitchen, I'll give you the exact one of these you're gonna need. You're gonna need half a cup of Dijon mustard, half a cup of honey, one full stick of butter. You mix everything together. I like melting the butter and mixing the ingredients in a stove top. And then I pour that on top of the chicken breasts on the crock pot. It's usually cooked in four hours on high or seven hours on low. And your whole house will smell like deliciousness. I promise you. It's the end of the work day and about 520. I'm walking my Annie. There's a lot of animals around. Like that squirrel. There's a lot of them. And Annie doesn't care. <laughs> Editing me right here. I realized I didn't say goodbye in the vlog from yesterday and I'm already filming another vlog for you guys. I hope you're enjoying these videos. I wanted to show you kind of my performance during yesterday's run. You're gonna see here the different splits. So really what I did is I just followed a Peloton run with Olivia Amato and I lapped on my Garmin so that it would measure the speed in those fast intervals because I really wanted to track that. Actually, they went really, really well. They, I was kind of fast in some of them. I went even all the way to like 720, I think it won. So yeah, and the 20 seconds at the very end when I was already gassed, they were very, very fast. One of them I did in five, four, yeah, I think. So yeah, things are moving forward. I am happy again running. I had a couple of days in which I was a little bit down I was over wine glass marathon and what happened, but still, it's just, I don't know, that uneasy feeling, which is, it's all gone now. So we're moving forward and we're gonna have a lot of fun at Dopey, guys. So if you're running Dopey or any of the other marathon weekend races, let me know in the comments below. We will have a meetup. I've been getting hit already with messages about you know, which parks I'm gonna go to and all that. I don't know yet for sure, but we will have a meetup. So at least one, if not two. So yes, stick around for that, you guys. Hope your training is going well. And as always, run fearless, you guys. Bing.